Bart. Oh, it's going awesome. And I, I shared earlier that normally there's a basketball game going on here. A much different cause this time. Not entertainment, but life-saving, life-preserving measures going on as people are donating blood, which will be given, which is a, a great thing to see. And when you come to an event like this, you hear stories of a guy who had too much iron in his system and would have to give blood weekly. He hated giving blood weekly until he met the little girl that needed a weekly supply of blood to live. And he goes, oh my gosh, now I can't wait to give. And I give with an open heart each week. Let's bring in uh, Dharma Nichols, uh, the uh, district manager for the Red Cross. Dharma, tell me about this uh, blood drive and why is this time of year uh, a time where blood is more needed? Well, absolutely. So we're here at San Diego State in the beautiful VA Haas Arena. Yeah. Um, it's a fantastic blood drive. It has the distinction of being the largest collegiate blood drive in California. So I'm thrilled that it's right here in San Diego. No doubt. Um, this is a great time of year to give blood because the need for blood is constant. Mm -hmm. And as we approach the holidays, it's not necessarily on everybody's to-do list ah. to give blood. So yep. we still need that blood, and it's it's really important to give this time of year and to give often. I know it's a lot of students that are giving. Mm -hmm. Who will be receiving this blood? Is it Does it stay in the county? Does it go further out than that? So it, it does actually both. Mm -hmm. um, so at Red Cross, the blood that we collect goes local first, but we also have the ability through our rare match program to send it really anywhere in the country that it's needed. Okay. Or if there's a large scale disaster, it can all go there. So it's here first mm -hmm. and, and wherever needed second. So it, it's really just a great program. And I know people can still walk in today, walk up and give. Uh, what's in the goodie bag if they come and, and donate the blood? Well, aside like, from feeling good about themselves. Right, aside from saving lives, yes. which is definitely a good thing. <laughs> um, people can get, we have our, this is our seventh annual Aztecs for Life. Nice. So we have our collector's edition t-shirts. This year it's gray and um, they're fabulous. So you'll definitely want one of these for your collection. Okay. We also have the Elf socks celebrating <laughs> the 20 years of Elf. Nice. Um, and so so these are kind of a fun giveaway. Plus, we have tons of food giveaway. Okay. We have free lunch provided by Antis. We've got, um, we've got Jersey Mike's. We've got oh. uh, Woodstock's. We've got uh, Eureka. We've it, got all kinds of stuff. Is all that free food stuff that us media types can take part in as well? Absolutely. So anybody that's saving lives gets that. Okay. Very good. <laughs> and if someone can't come down, they where do they go online to, to give if they're not able to come down today? So go to redcrossblood.org and you can type in your zip code to find a local blood drive. However, we are taking walk-ins today. Mm -hmm. The rain has slowed a few people coming in, yeah. so we have space. Come on down and donate. All right, Dharma, thank you very much for that. Thank uh, you. Netta and Heather, let's go back to you. Great time. They're open here till 6 o'clock tonight.